everybody, Derek here with Addictive Tips. In this video, I'm going to be going over how to set up compositing on Linux desktops that are lightweight desktop environments. In this demonstration, I'm going to be using the XFCE desktop environment because it arguably requires the most setup and it's probably the most confusing. But that being said, you know, there are different uh, you know, there are different types of uh, desktops that this can get working on. So to start off, you'll need to get into the terminal and uh, install Compton as well as Compton Conf. It's a configuration tool. So do sudo apt install Compton and all right, oops, <laughs> Conf. Yeah, to attack Y just to get it to do it automatically. Now, as this goes through and starts up, I'm going to go up here and I'm going to search for Window Window Manager Tweaks. Okay, so the XFCE desktop already has compositing, but as you can see, it's not the greatest and it's kind of actually really terrible. So you're going to need to go through and uh, disable compositing. And as you can see, everything looks flat now. Compositing, no compositing, compositing, no compositing. You get the idea. So we will now do the Compton Conf. So to be to to start off, in the article I go over a guide on how to set up a desktop file. And this is because on some versions of desktop environments there is no startup manager, but on Zubuntu, which I'm using in my VM here for the sake of demonstration, there actually is a startup manager, so I can just make the desktop file without needing to do a copy paste. So I'm going to do that now. And to do that, I would do startup and look for sessions and startup. Application auto start and uh, click add Compton. And then the command would be Compton B. So moving on, we've got Compton enabled for startup. Now all we need to do is open up our, ta our manager here and look for Compton Conf. So by default, Compton has some pretty good settings enabled by default. It's got the shade settings. We can even change the shade if we want to. We can disable DND &D on Windows. We can change the opacity for menus. We can change the blur background, pretty much everything. Once I'm satisfied with the settings, I can click the apply button. And then I will just do Alt F2 and then run Compton. Now, as you can see, my Windows are completely transparent because that's how I've chosen to make it look. I can also, like I said, uh, completely disable that. Click apply and then go to the terminal here, pkill Compton, and then do Compton again. And now the foreground window is not so weird. And we've also got animations now when we minimize. And uh, if we want to disable the startup, for the window manager, the setup for Compton that we have, we would go config and then auto start. And then you see the Compton.desktop file. We can just click delete. And once I click the delete button, Compton will no longer load at startup and to, that will completely disable it. And at any time you can you know, you go to startup and create another configuration again. So guys, that was how to set up so guys, that was how to set up. Uh, so guys, that was how to set up compositing on lightweight desktop environments for Linux. This is Derek, and I will see you in the next one.